title would lead you to understand, maybe, I came across a, a verse of scripture that I, had, I probably had seen before, but, <clears throat> you know, it seemed a little more real to me today. And as I meditated on it for a little bit, other scriptures started popping up. So, Father, open our hearts today, Lord, to receive this truth. <clears throat> May no one get caught up on the fact that I need a haircut. But maybe they'll hear you, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Well, the scripture was... Uh, Possession of a man is diligence. The precious possession of a man is diligence. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. The precious possession of a man is diligence. What have you been diligent about? been diligent about. <clears throat> show me the areas you've been diligent about and I'll show you the areas you're getting victory in. Indeed. Another scripture I'm thinking of, the hand of the diligent makes rich. after that thing. Let this be a year that you don't sit back and say, oh, well, okay, sirrah, sirrah, whatever will be, will be. No, that's a bunch of crock of crap. If, if the Lord sat back and said, whatever will be, will be, this place wouldn't even be. That's for real. And if you don't create purpose create your world around you, it'll default into what what we see around us for the most part. Uh, cancel culture. Hide your face where we can't take your identity from you. Beat you down. No. Not me. The precious possession of a man is diligent. The one who guards his mouth preserves his life. The one who opens wide his mouth. Sorry. Today, as you uh, are traveling through the life, remember your diligence is your precious possession. And I'll see you in the next.